there is yet another hurricane related death in Volusia County. This time we are told a nine year old boy died and his family is now in the hospital. New Six's Lauren Corn joins us live from the scene. Lauren, police say the family had carbon monoxide poisoning from their generator. Yes, that's right. I just arrived to the scene here off of Mason and Mason Park Avenue. This street here, it still does not have power. So that family had a generator inside one of the rooms and it happened this morning. And within minutes, uh, you know, police say that the, the nine year old passed away, that the daughter, she was vomiting, dizzy. It happened so quick that they were rushed to the hospital where we've been told they say that the dad is, is not doing well. He's worse off than the rest of the family, but they went to the hospital. They have uh, police tape around the home and they're airing out the windows as we speak. And they say it's going to take several hours to get all of that out. And they say, you know, this is deadly. That's why it's so important not to have these generators inside the home because you can't see this carbon monoxide. You can't see it at all. And it, and it can kill. And unfortunately in this situation, it did. So police are taking over this investigation. They're still out here right now, and they are telling me it's at the beginning stages. Um, so we'll be following the story for the rest of the day, and we'll be giving you the latest updates um, on TV and on ClickOrlando.com. But very sad situation out here.